brought his a own rod. A fella brought me out fishing off the coast of Belmullet. On a date? like No, no. It was a few of us going, right? Go and on, uh, I was bringing two friends that weren't from around. They were, they were from Ireland, like, but they weren't from around Mayo. So I brought them out Strangers. fishing. Strangers. So this fella says, oh, I'll take you out in the boat, right? <laughs> so, of course. Three girls. They thought, three girls. No, there was a man and a woman. So I said to him. Swingers. So the first thing. <laughs> was it? First thing he Swinger did. Swinger Island. We arrived out anyway, got left off by this local fella from Belmullet at the boat. And they said, oh, is, is this the boat that we'll be going out fishing on? I says, oh, not at all. I said, this is probably, probably bringing us to his right boat. No one fine well it was one of those. He had two engines at the top of it. You know the typical boat you'd see on a lake? A like, boat boat, yeah. A lake boat, as opposed to a one you'd bring out in the sea. If You know what I mean? They're like little blue kind of undercarriages and they've like four little little seats across them. I don't know. I'm not familiar with boating terms. I'm no, not sure. You're not doing a great job of describing this boat. <laughs> Just either. a small wooden boat. F- perfect. With two yeah, engines. You'll yes. save a lot of time if you start <laughs> off your description. So of he that. The, and he says the first thing he says to us uh, I brought a packet of biscuits for you for the journey. Uh, I bought chocolate chip ones. Do you like them? I says oh Jesus yeah absolutely. So anyway we got into the boat life jackets on and uh Shenda said to me, she goes, Shenda? Yeah, she goes, um, <laughs> she goes, are we, are we, are we going out on this boat to him? Oh, Jesus, he says, we are, we are, we are. So anyway, we go, he goes right out, like, and I mean, he's out in the sea at this stage and I'm sitting there going, don't think I'm going to make it back. Just the water was coming right, splashing in at you, right? Your hand is here and the sea, yeah. like the sea is like so f- Scary, yeah. yes. and here we are out in this little boat. Anyway, we there's no it. roads in the sea, Whew. so we're out there, and I'm thinking, All that's water. it now. I'm dead. I'm not going to make it back, and I have to make and peace we... with myself now that I'm not going to come back here. So anyway, he land out, stops the engines, oh, way terrible. way out, like you could see <laughs> not the cliffs. <laughs> you could see the, the cliffs out at uh, Ballycastle. How many of you were in this small boat? It was five of us. A man and a woman, and, and Shenda and was there, and was she? Shenda was there, Shenda. and Charles. Where? Shenda Prin- and Charles. Prince, Prince Charles, the a prince from Nigeria. He was what? in the bush, yeah. So anyway, there, there. Oh, hang on a second. Whoa. Shenda yeah. and the prince of Nigeria yeah. were on a boat with you in Clue Bay. No, and out in the Atlantic Ocean. Oh, there's my microphone. It's just yeah, but what part? Uh, out in Belmullet, off the coast, oh, like on the Atlantic Ocean. And where? How did you get a prince from Nigeria on a boat? They're friends of friends of mine, friends of mine. So, um, which was very disappointing to be on this little little boat, right? And here's your man, typical Mayo, typical Belmullet, right? And um, so, was this supposed to impress the prince? Like, was he supposed to... Well, in Tommy, do your terms. Niger- Let Tommy do his Nigerian accent here. No. Go I, on, Tommy. No, no need for just... Go a... on, Tommy. Well, welcome. welcome uh, no, that's no, not it. No, no, go on, Tommy. No, I, I, He's uh, not Indian. What the fuck is this place I am here in? <laughs> He's got a very, his accent's very <laughs> cultured because he's lived in Ireland for years. Well, I can't so. do an accent unless I feel encouraged do and confident. Do the Nigerian <laughs> prince. <laughs> do, a, do the Nigerian I just want to say that this has been a great day for me to go fishing with you in Belmullet. <laughs> but I cannot swim. None of my family, where I come from, is a landlocked country. We have no sea. What? This water does not, t- it's... It, it's salty water. I do not <laughs> like salty water. Shenda, Shenda. Well, Shenda. <laughs> no, don't worry. Chocolate I am chip ju- cookies. I am just asking Shenda why. It, don't, please, this is a dispute. This is a dispute between Shenda and myself. We will, we will sort it out. <laughs> I wonder, I wonder, would you ask that vision man, please, could he turn the boat around and get us? (laughs) <laughs> Leave it out, Shenda. Oh, poor old Shenda got an earful. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't finish this story. I don't know if this, war- if this oh, story please. warrants an end now. Please finish. So, what happened please. anyway? So, please anyway, we went out fishing. So, he stops the boat, stops the engine, and. <laughs> <laughs> Drive the boat! Drive the boat! <laughs> <laughs> Stop. 
stop. And he says, he says, we're as well do a bit of fishing now. He says, did you ever do a bit of fishing before? <laughs> la la sa <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, give a fuck about fishing. Get me back to land right now. <laughs> Lagos. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Shenda Princess Shenda And the Prince of Nigeria So he, a- he asked what he asked So we went fishing And uh, the next thing So he drops You know I said Oh where's the fishing rods Oh just have it here It was just like a piece of timber About That's that, is that a, Did you uh, charter this boat Did you about pay a foot, this man no, for this No no About a foot long <laughs> It's piece a foot of long fishing rod No yes It was a piece of timber Was he, was he stopping the with, fish or something With a load of like Fishing line Tied on Wrapped it. around it And a few hooks on it and I think I'm I'm there going, oh Christ above! Is this like? Is what this what like, was fucking Prince McKenna saying? He was, uh, you can say, he was yeah. amazed by okay. what was going on. So anyway, put down. He dropped down the line. As he drops down the line, he says to me, "Do you see that milk carton over there?" And uh, it was one of those plastic milk cartons. You know what the handle on it? What? <laughs> and he opens. There's a hole in the side of it, and he goes, "Give me that there." Now he says, "I need to do a little wee wee." Right, so we're at the boat stopped. He's gonna put it fall. back. Put that <laughs> back in your pants right now. Oh, what no. are you using that for a bit? What? <laughs> so he hands. I'll show you a cock. <laughs> I'll show you a cock. <laughs> you could catch Moby Dick on this dick. <laughs> Uh, so he hands Charlie the he hands Charlie the fishing thing, whatever you call it, and he starts pissing into this little milk thing, right? And then he pours it out into the water and pulls up the fish. I thought Shenda was going to die right there and then. And he says to us, "We're getting off the boat. Would you like a couple of these fish to bring home?" <laughs> no, your grand thanks. I have never in my uh, life, Larita, heard anything like that. It in was like. I think that's one of the best fucking stories I've heard on this <laughs> podcast. Sorry, this story is so long it needs to be broke up into sections. But so we're on the way back, right? Charlie's starting to maybe get sick now because the boat is, is like... Prince Charlie. The the boat, the pr- yeah, the Prince. Yeah. Prince Charles. How's the Shenda? boat is... The Shenda's fine, but the boat's wa- wafting, if that's the right word, no, or wa- waving. Or yeah, wafting is the word smell. used for a smell. But it moves, that's why. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's, so, yeah, yeah. could you? Mm-hmm. I can let that go. I can, I can yeah. let that go. Would you let it go? Wafting. Uh, yeah, wafting. Yeah, we let that go. Yeah, wafting, I think wafting. it sounds good. It's the next thing he says. Now, we, you have a little treat for you, he says. I did that in New Zealand. Wafted. Time. Yeah. White water. <laughs> White water wafted. <laughs> <laughs> So oh, Jesus, um, me and my friend went white water wafting, <laughs> wafting. So he thanks just to clarify that I didn't say that. Um, but he gives us little, you know, this little f- uh, good all. I think they're little food coloring bottles. Yes, you, yeah, with the label taken off, and he gives us all one of them. That's dropping a butchin for you now. He says, drink it up. So of course I drank mine, and Ch- Charlie, you can take him off again in a second said I, he wasn't sure if it was something he could drink yeah. so anyway we get back in to the we get out of the boat alive alive thanks I really did think yeah. this is it got out he put us into his van then to bring us back into Belmullet Town and he opens the back door of the highest van and he says now ladies you can sit in here <laughs> he opened the van and there was a side table there was an armchair, and there was a bed in the back. Bolted down to the f- on the bolted down, t- down <laughs> to the back of the highest oh, van. Classic. With a duvet on it, and the whole lot. <laughs> and he says to us, "You can sit in there now, girls." So we sat on the bed. Then there's no in window. The there's there's no windows or anything. So you're sitting there in pure darkness, going, <laughs> "This is like." The whole thing was not no bizarre enough this that we were on this boat. In you go, girls. In you go. And here he is. Shenda thought she's been trafficked again. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> so then he goes. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is not the first time I've been in a dark van <laughs> travelling across land. No, Shenda's not from Nigeria. Oh. so <laughs> Where's she from? She's from Dublin. Shenda. Shenda from Dorky, is it? No. Go on anyway. So so, <laughs> so we, we sat into the back of the van and the next thing he's there swigging out of the bottle. <laughs> I realise I didn't have to do that for purposes. Well, this is not on. graphic. But he's, so Charlie says to him, uh, what, what, is, 
what is that you're drinking? Yeah. And he says, just it's a bit more of that stuff in that stuff we had out in the boat. He says, just another little dropping to warm me up on the way in. So he's he's driving the van. <laughs> <laughs> drinking the machine. What a story. And the three women are in pitch black. Two of us in the back going, oh, for fuck. And did you think you were going to get road or something? Was there... <laughs> no, he told, he told me he sometimes sleeps in the van. In you ah, go now, right, girls. Yeah. Yeah. So Can like, I ask you, are you still in touch with the Prince of Nigeria? Yes, yes, oh, yes. Oh man, yes. we're going to have so many podcast downloads in Lagos. <laughs>